TMI tag, too much information, or as Ranjish says in How I Met Your Mother, too many informations. So you get to watch a video of me answering 50 questions about my favorite topic in the world, myself. My glasses and my favorite Firefly t-shirt that says, curse your sudden but inevitable betrayal. Yes. A long time ago, distant past of 2009, it wasn't the ideal relationship, but what relationship is ideal? Uh, but it's over now, it just, it wasn't meant to be, and it wasn't meant to be the second and third time we tried to date either. Yeah, I've had a few. I'm 5'6". Two hundred and seventy pounds. I have this one tattoo that is my name, T R E Y, in Dwarvish from Lord of the Rings. It's kind of the start of a family tree. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get my dad's tattoo uh, this month, actually in August. Uh, my dad's name tattooed in Dwarvish here, and you know my mom's, and then my brothers, and you know the whole family. <laughs> Because I, I don't mind needles. I, I don't mind needles. What, what worries me about piercings is putting them in my ears or anywhere else and then them getting ripped out because of the movie The Punisher. The one with Tom Jane uh, that wasn't that good, but there was that one scene where they're ripping out the guy who has like 50 piercings in his face and they're just ripping him out one by one. <laughs> What is OTP? One true pairing. Relationship and fiction tasks. So OTP is like shipping. I'm not a really big shipper. I just kind of take, you know, accept whatever relationships are in the story. Right now it's definitely Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. It's my favorite show on TV. I love that show. Led Zeppelin and the Beatles definitely are lifelong favorites. Sticks, Dropkick Murphys, and Flogging Molly. I miss Jazz Fest every year. I never, I never get to go. I've never been, or many other fests, musical fests in New Orleans. I usually miss them. Come sail away. Not because it's a great song, it's an okay song, but it has a lot of emotional meaning and, uh, I guess, nostalgic meaning for me in my life. So yeah, Come Sail Away by Styx. I am 25. I'm a Pisces. Humor. Intelligence, those are probably the two big ones. Um, personality and wit. You lost today, kid. But that doesn't mean you have to like it. From Indiana Jones and The Last Crusade. Harrison Ford. say it's a pretty close tie between red, blue, and green, but dark red, blues, and greens. It really depends on my mood. If I'm in uh, a really good mood, it's loud music, usually Dropkick Murphy's really loud in my car. If not, it's the Transistor soundtrack, um, just kind of playing, not that loud. Fortunately, I'm sad most of the time, so I go everywhere. It takes me at least 30 minutes. I will just sit there and relax and think 
for probably about 20 minutes and I'll just sit there and just kind of unwind and then the last 10 minutes is actual like showering. I do not know of this morning of which you speak. It really depends on what I have to do. Uh, if I have to like get up early and get ready and get all clean then it'll, it'll take me you know 15-20 minutes. Uh, if I just have to get up and go somewhere, like I get up in the morning for class, I'm usually up in five minutes. But if it was just a regular day where I don't even have to get up, I probably won't get up in the morning. I'll probably get up afternoon, probably after two o'clock. I've never been in a fight, but we were drunk one night um, in the French Quarter. My friend punched me in the back. You don't hit somebody in the back. Chucks, Converse, or and or glasses. No confidence, little personality, like not having a personality, and just kind of being mean. To focus on doing something creative, you know, creative outlet, uh, a way to you know talk about my opinions on the things I love. Uh, you know, things like that, to talk to you, to help y'all if there's any way I can. Cockroaches. Recently, I was thinking about lightsabers, and I was thinking about this character in The Clone Wars, this, uh, a young Jedi Padawan by the name of Gunji. He was a young Wookiee. And he was training to be a Jedi, and he went through the trials to make his lightsaber, and when he thought about it, he was like, mm, the Force is telling me that my lightsaber should be wood. It should be made out of wood, which is a totally, which is totally a thing. There's a bark that he can use, and it's a very rare bark, but they had it in the lightsaber workstation. Uh, to make his lightsaber with, so he made this, you know, this wooden encased lightsaber, and it was so awesome. And I was thinking the other day, uh, just about the character and about his awesome lightsaber, and I was like, man, he would have been an awesome Jedi when he grew up. And then I remembered Order 66 and what happened at the Jedi Temple and Darth Vader and the younglings, and I realized Gunji probably died. <laughs> ago and I kind of regret it not because not because it was a bad thing but it I, I thought I was in love at the time and I wasn't that's not something you throw around lightly <music> guillotine uh, is actually just a gamer tag I came up with because my last name because it, it spells uh, the first parts of my last name uh, by adding teen guillotine the Last Witch, which is the first book in the Witcher saga. Uh, it's a like it's a book of short stories about Geralt. Sword of Destiny, which is the second book in the Witcher saga. Daredevil. Uh, I watched it. Tuesday, uh, Wednesday, Tuesday and Wednesday so that I could write the review uh, to put out Wednesday. Probably my brother and sister at their house the other day. Last person I texted. Who is that? Last person I texted is my good friend Kelly, who I was texting her to check up on her, see how she was doing. Triple bacon cheeseburger, extra cheese, uh, with french fries. From Five Guys. I would really, really like to visit London. I went to the grocery store the other day to get some milk. I don't think I'd say I have a crush right now, aside from maybe Ivy Doom Kitty or Megan Tonjes, uh, just because I think they're beautiful women and they have great personalities and they do 
uh, a lot to spread, you know, a positive message, and they're all about body positivity, and like I said, I just, I think they're gorgeous, and they're, they're amazing women, so I would say I definitely have celebrity crushes on them, but if I, for, but as for like, you know, a crush with, you know, women that I know, I, I wouldn't call them crushes, like there's, you know, there's, there's two or three women who, that I know that are just amazing and I find them incredibly attractive and they have amazing personalities and they're good people and I love hanging out with them and I love talking with them and I would love to get to know them better and to spend more time with them uh, and to be more intimate with them. Um, so I wouldn't say they're crushes but I'm definitely very much attracted to uh, like you know two or three women. Um, that I would definitely, you know, if the opportunity presented itself, uh, go out with. The last time I was insulted was probably through a YouTube comment. I was told that I was fucking retarded. Anything chocolate and peanut butter. Or cheesecake. in middle school and high school, I played the drums. I really only have one. I have my silver bracelet. It was my dad's. Um, there's, there's really no special meaning behind it, but it was my dad's. I did multiplayer of Halo and Borderlands recently. Does like multiplayer video games count as sports? song don't worry about me don't worry about me i'll be fine i'll find someone like you i feel like that song is very passive aggressive and i don't like the message of it but it's been stuck in my head so i've probably sung that once or twice hi do you have a cigarette i could bum yes it's the only pickup line i know it's the only way that i get the confidence enough to to approach and talk to a woman is to ask if they're smoking a cigarette, which kind of limits the field because that means I can only uh, use it on women who are currently smoking in the vicinity. Has it ever actually worked? Not really. My brother and sister, uh, yesterday, uh, I was over at my brother's house because he just got out of surgery and he's pretty much bedridden. Uh, and by bedridden, I mean like couch ridden, and he's sitting in front of the couch playing videos, video games for the next six weeks. So I was over there hanging out with him while he played Batman, and my sister showed up at some point. So, uh, yeah, brother and sister, sister in law to be specific. You should answer the questions next. Let me get to know you a little bit better. on this or any other video in the month of July, you can enter for a chance to win this Mad Monty Funko figure. And this is the last video to do it in because this is the last video in July. So I'll announce the winner on the next video that will be in August. So leave a comment, enter for a chance to win. If you like the video and the TMI tag, like the video, share it around, and definitely subscribe to my channel so I can geek out some more. Thanks for watching. One, so Captain America, Thor, Hulk.